Hello and welcome back to the Crash Team Racing Safari. I am your tour guide, Hero Side Quest. We are playing Clockwork Wampa, and holy crap, look at how much there is already to look at. Look at that torch. Or whatever that's supposed to be. That lantern. Okay. With the cool little wood grain on there. Look at these beautiful bells with all the cool luxury on them. And thankfully not going as loud as they actually would be in real life. Because that'd be deafening, and that would not be fun. They definitely look painted, don't they? Instead of actually gold. Wonder what those barrels are full of behind us. Behind them. With all that purple there. Wonder what that glowing stuff is back there, too. Anyways, look at how pretty this is. It looks very fairy tale esque You know, kind of like roses, but also kind of like bat wings. Very interesting. Are these supposed to be spiked? Or are they decorative? Like witch's hats? I, I don't know. So this place kind of has a fairy tale vibe to it. <gasps> Look at the floorboards. Look at all the wood grain on the floorboards. <gasps> so pretty. Look at these bolts. This looks so cool. Okay. Okay. We have to move on a little bit better. We kind of spent a long time last time. We're about to fall over. That thing said, look at the cool snow graphics. <gasps> look at the aurora in the background. I never noticed that before. I'm just too busy trying to race for my life. I absolutely love this level. I'm not good at it, but I love it. Beautiful wood grain, beautiful stones. This is just a feast for the eyes. Oh, so pretty. I love those lanterns. I wonder what's in there. Probably food or something. What's that? That's supposed to be Wumpa fruit? They're barrels of Wumpa fruit. And they have a stein tacked on. Just saying, with a nail that big, would it kind of pierce a Wumpa fruit? Huh, caution signs. Wonder why. No, this isn't. What is this supposed to be? Like a math scientist eccentric lab or something? Because it has electricity and all this stuff, but it's very yieldy style in my humble opinion. What's all that purple stuff in the bank and those? I'm never going to be able to unsee that now. Instead of racing, I'm going to be too busy admiring the pretty water effects on the purple liquid. We're looking at that strange turning bit up there. The axle, I guess? It's kind of weirdly shaped, isn't it? Uh, somebody who knows machines should tell me. But it's actually turning and turning and it looks really weird. Whatever. Back again to these really pretty flagstones. Really well done looking. Is it dripping? Why is it dripping? Can we see from over here? Is there a pipe over there that's dripping? Weird. Oh, it's the evil chicken. Oh, hello, evil chicken. <laughs> I had no idea the chicken was here. You chased a tiger, didn't you, good chicken? Do you think you could kill a couple of links for me? Your feathers are quite nice. Is that enough? Okay, you really look like you're drugged out of your mind. Like, all this powder isn't actually snow. It's something else. And that's probably going to give me an adult rating on this one, isn't it? <gasps> Look at all the wampas! Oh my gosh. They weren't cutting when they called it Clockwork Wampa. You see how this all stuff is just going so well and the machines are doing so well, except for then all of a sudden we have these random leaks and all these missing floorboards and all these windows, they're just gone. But these huge machines. Very mad scientist esque. Or I guess evil villainess esque? I don't know. But look at those little droplet physics! They're so good! It actually splashes up! And the foes dissipates. It's so pretty! It's so well done! Wow. 
Okay, now that's bothering me. Why aren't they spilling out? Are they that well packed? Because I'm pretty sure if they're like apples, then they just bruise and make room for each other. Or make cider. I don't know. Did you know there's actually a bacteria on apples that causes the one bad one to spoil the bunch? True fact. I don't know the full details, but that's the heavily abridged version. Oh, do you see it up there? That looks like a wampa fruit, is it? Oh, by the way, look at the cool gears. This is so cool looking. There's a big bell up there, too. I wonder what this purple liquid is. It's being transported by all those carts. Look, wait. Dang it. Actually, we're going off again. Because look at those side, the corners there. How they all line up like that. Kind of like a wood cabin. It's also all the way down here. Can you see that? It's kind of a split second. Eh, the editor will show it. Slow it down for you. That is really cool, all those arcs and everything else. Did I just squish myself? Okay, that's what I did apparently. Look at those cool wumpa fruits up there. Like stained glass or something? I don't know. It's just really cool looking. I'm assuming it's wumpa because it's, you know, been heavily featured. It's even called Clockwork Wumpa. Fun fact, I had no idea that's the shortcut straight ahead. I just thought that was the way you took. So, for once, I'm gonna go up here. Check out what's up here. These barrels. And I can't believe they're not just popping their tops after seeing how many Wumpa fruit were spilling out before. Oh, what? What is with that one? That looks like... Ugh. These ones have so much cool detail to them. And this one is just... Ugh. You have all those pretty railings. Oh my gosh, look up there. That is cool looking. Wish that was part of the shortcut. I said, I wish we could do Dark Souls style or Dishonored style and just climb up there and check it out. It looks so cool. I love all the wood grain and then matched by actual planks and stuff like that. I really just want to climb all over that. Okay, now I can take cool glass windows. I wonder if they're showing in the Alvora or some sort of magic or technology or something. All the fittings and the pipes look really good too. This is a really well done detailed place. I really love this place. It's crazy, it's amazing to drive, but it's also just really pretty. Oh my gosh, there's a lake of the purple stuff over there. No, I will take my shortcut. Ooh, look at the plank flooring. That's really cool looking. Really great creepy vibes in this game sometimes. Ooh, look how cool the gears are. You can see the little tear turny things. Yeah, I couldn't really get a good look at them. Sorry. You stop and you die. Look at that arrow. It's got all those cool little vector swirly things. That's so pretty. Wow, look at those mountains. That just looks like they're pretty as a painting. Would that make me see them better? Love how concave that one is. So cool looking. Look at that red roof. That's got tiles and everything to it. Those arches have all sorts of stylistic to them. The bells again styled, just like the other ones were. This is pretty amazing. No, no, stop. Huh, more of that purple stuff. Now I've gotta know what this purple stuff is. I'm gonna have to look into it. I love this. I fall for it too often. Really cool moose mist effects though. Eh, I think we're gonna have to go down it. We have to see what's there. You're not allowed to see. You're only allowed to stare at the creepy batty gargoyle thingies. They really look more like pigs than gargoyles. Hmm. I really want to show off the shortcut, but eh, there's 
too much else to look at. It's supposed to be like a giant vat of this stuff? Holy crap, look how creepy that gargoyle up there is. The gargoyle has acquired the wump of fruit. Gargoyles have the wump of fruit. And the hour hand is going backwards. Oh. I'm sure there's some significance to that. Yeah, I'm not going nearly fast enough. Yeah, that was a whole big bat of that stuff. Again, these windows weren't even attempted to be boarded up. What is that? <sighs> that does not look safe to mess with. Seriously, that's just creepy. Do these gears actually fit together? They actually make it into like real gears. Wow, that is really well done. Just attention to detail, so well done. Hey, is this where the blue ones were before? I wonder if that's just the candlelight showing through or like the warmth, the warm light showing through. Or if there's some sort of weird magic enchantments. Hey, look at that gargoyle. It's actually kind of creepy. It looks like he's about to dump that bat all over you. Ugh. Are those, like, springs around the planet? The stone's off in the distance. You can see them above the castle and around the mountains. Really weird. Oh, look, they have more swirls on that little vase of fire. How cool is that? Can I jump back in? Darn. I think it'd be funny. I'm going for magic enchantment on the windows because that stuff. Did they just force me into the <laughs> they're getting tired of my crap. Oh look at the three wumpa. That is too cool. Oh hell the wumpa fruit. Oh hell the wumpa fruit. I need a crowd behind me saying this crap. This really looks like good old fashioned cartoon moving pipes that are about to burst. Ooh, pretty. Oh, it's a bat again. It's a bat gargoyle on top of that pocket watch looking thing. With another wump of fruit right in the middle. I'm really starting to think this is the cult of the Wumpas. And I think all this purple stuff is what comes out of the Wumpa fruit that makes us so go so fast. And before you argue with me, blueberries are blue, their juice is purple, and I can't remember the last random thing. I think it's when you bake them to turn brown or something. I don't know. And we're finally back to where we started. Only about 13 minutes later. I don't know what these arches were for. I wonder if there was actually just kind of like covering over here before. And this was the entrance into the castle. Look, that one's actually going right. Both the hour hand and minute hand are going correct, but the hour hand's going way faster. I'm not gonna get too meta about this. I'm not gonna go into the time related nonsense. Holy crap, that's a lot of wonder fruit. And yes, I like those chains as well. I think those are very well done. I bet I could go to any place I don't like even and find awesome stuff. Because there's just so many beautiful pieces to each one of these levels. Ah, I just wish that there was a mode where we could do something crazy and like stop it and take pictures or, you know, like a photo mode or just chill out and have fun with it. And this game is all about racing so far ahead that you don't get to enjoy all these amazing details. It's just too beautiful of a game. It really is. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Please do like and subscribe. 
because I will be doing more safaris and I'd really like to show this with you and then hopefully when I get back up on my feet I can start doing some LPs and other things that require more intense editing and the like. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. For now, just know that if I'm gone, it's usually because I've got some sort of surgery or PT or something else like that that's really heavy. Anyways, I will see you all later. Thanks so much for watching and prepare for our next safari.